If Crunchyroll isn't working for you and all you're getting is just a black screen, well there's several different things that could be causing it, so let's go over them and how exactly you can troubleshoot this issue in this very video. Now a common cause of this strange behavior is incompatible extensions on your browser. So what you want to do is click over on your extensions, usually in the top right corner, and turn off any you find there. Then you can just add them back one by one until you find your culprit. If you have any kind of screen capture software running, well usually as a kind of anti-piracy method, video playback on sites like Crunchyroll, Netflix, Prime Video, anything else like that is going to mess up and display a black screen instead. So if you have something like OBS open, make sure to turn that off. If you have something like say Nvidia Instant Replay on, make sure to turn that off or anything else like that. Another issue could be cache buildup and something in the cache causing these issues. So if you want to clear the cache, well it differs slightly depending on which browser you're using, but let's just stick to Chrome given how that's by far the most popular option. Click on this button next to the URL, then head over to the cookie section. Then click on the manage button and delete anything that pops up in this window in the middle. Another issue could be permissions, more specifically when it comes to pop-up and redirects. So you want to make sure that Crunchyroll is on any list you may have of allowed websites for that. So simply go into your settings, then select privacy and security, then click on site settings and then go into the pop-ups and redirects section. Then make sure that Crunchyroll is added there as an allowed site. Then simply just refresh the page and see if it helps. Another issue could just be a bad internet connection. While it doesn't require too much bandwidth to actually stream on Crunchyroll, well, if your internet just isn't good enough, it could be causing these kind of issues. So try to load literally anything else on any other website and see if it actually loads properly. You may always want to do a sanity check by going to a website like speedtest.net and see if you're actually getting the speeds you would expect from your internet service provider. Or if you're on mobile, you may want to switch over from Wi-Fi to mobile data or vice versa and see if that helps. So those are all of the main ways that you can try and troubleshoot a black screen appearing when you're trying to watch anything on Crunchyroll. If none of these solve the issue, it could be something a bit deeper, so you want to contact the support team directly, but also keep an eye out on the social media and see if people are reporting the same issue, or if it's something that the team is already aware of and are working on a fix. So hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to subscribe to How to Authority for more like this in the future.